Hi everyone, welcome back to UWorld's question of the day. My name is Samantha, I am a nurse here at UWorld. Today we're back with another question for our OB week. So here, the nurse is planning care for a client who is pregnant and has severe preeclampsia. Which of the following interventions should the nurse include in the client's plan of care? Select all that apply. Go ahead and drop your answers in the comments below and I'll jump into our rationale. So this client is notified as having preeclampsia. This is a hypertensive disorder of pregnancy. It occurs at or after 20 weeks of gestation. We're gonna see proteinuria in these clients and it can present with or without signs of end organ damage that can lead to eclampsia or seizure activity. So our expected interventions are gonna be things like focusing on seizure prevention because there's the proclivity for these clients to have a seizure. We're also going to want to make sure we check those DTRs or tendon reflexes. Brisk reflexes are an indicator of an impending seizure. We're going to want to make sure we get that magnesium sulfate. This is given via IV drip as seizure prophylaxis. And lastly, we want to minimize those environmental stimuli because this can also make us more likely to see. So things like loud music, loud family members, bright lights, we're going to want to tone down or get all of those things out of the client's environment. Lastly is our incorrect option. That's that administering carboprost. This is hemabate. This is given most commonly for postpartum hemorrhages, but we're not going to give this to a client that is still pregnant as this client is. So our correct options are one, three, four, and five. Click the link in our bio for more information on UWorld Nursing.